Welcome back. Ariana Moyer joining us once again here at the desk. She's got the top three trending things on our website, erienewsnow.com. Yeah, so we're going to start with the Wabtec closure that we mentioned on Friday, just in case you missed it. Then pallbearers were needed, but we have a good update for this veteran's funeral and a new year diet trend as you're making those resolutions. We'll talk about one that our Megan Selinski looked into last week. So as we mentioned on Friday, the Wabtec Corporation will be closing its facility in Allegheny County. The company put out a worker adjustment and retraining notification or a warn notice with the Department of Labor and Industry on Friday. The notice states that 94 employees will be laid off. The closures will be or the layoffs will begin February, March with the facility closing in July. Now this was negotiated right, with this the, was planned. Yes, with the UE 6110 in 2022. So they did know about it. Um, they just said that the facility was too deteriorated and wasn't meeting what they need yeah this wasn't a sudden oh my yes. goodness it's christmas and you're losing a job yes exactly not that it's it's still workers it's still affected, hard but, but at least yeah. they yes, knew there was a year that it was coming it wasn't yep. surprised um moving on a united states army veteran al hunk Javik lived on a farm in venango county all of his life and our philip ward talked to one of his daughters uh over the weekend and they needed pallbearers for his funeral but as of today they have all the volunteers they need, he will be laid to rest properly. Uh, he'll get the 21 shots as well as, or 21 salutes, uh, 21 gun salute, there we go. And we had volunteers for our Facebook post, but it looks like everybody has been filled according to Philip Ward. Speaks to the service of this region yes, to say the exactly. least. Finally, this 30-30-30 diet. Right? Yes, so this is a trend that involves, that's been trending on TikTok, so proceed with caution. Eating 30 grams of protein within 30 minutes of waking up, followed by 30 minutes of low intensity exercise. Size. So a LECOM health nutrition therapist said that that is one approach, however, not one size fits all. You need to do the proper research, uh, consult with your doctors before trying something like this because you don't know how it might affect you. But I know a lot of people are have that as one of their resolutions this year to get fit. So do what is best for you. Don't do things that are unhealthy or that are going to hurt you. Find out if this would work for with you by consulting your doctors or look into other, maybe not trends, but other avenues. Talk to a doctor, not Dr. TikTok. Yes. yes. All right.